The Lie Tree by Frances Hardinge is a captivating book that teaches children the importance of honesty. Published in 2015, but set back in the 1800s in Australia, this book illuminates the struggle of a young lady's coming of age. They suddenly and her family are forced to flee their childhood home due to her famous scientist father being a part of a reputation-destroying scandal. Shortly after moving to the island of Vane, Faith's father is discovered dead. No one on the island believes Faith that it was murder, so she sets out to find answers herself. After going through some of her father's scientific findings, Faith uncovers a lie tree that provides truth when being fed off of whispering lies. The bigger the lie, the more people on the island believe it is true, and the bigger the truth uncovered will be. By telling the tree a lie, the tree sprouts a fruit that will when eaten, will shed light on the truth. In attempts in discovering the truth about her father's death, Faith starts spreading lies throughout the whole island. And this is a passage I've chosen to read, and it's when Faith is first starting to discover the lie tree and how powerful that lies can be. A lie is like a fire, Faith was discovering. It needed to be nursed and fed, but carefully and gently, a slight breath would fan the newborn flames, but too vigorously a huff would blow it out. Some lies took hold, crackling with excitement, and no longer needed to be fed. But these were no longer your lies. They had a life and a shape of their own. There was no controlling them. This book has won multiple awards, two of them being the Costa Book of the Year Award in 2015 and the Costa Children's Book of the Award in 2015. This book does have some kind of vulgar language use as well as mentioning of sexual affairs. So I would target this book probably around seventh or eighth grade so those students can fully comprehend those topics brought up. Um, two points that I really liked in the book were the character Faith. I think she's an empowered, intelligent young woman and just based on the time shared period she's brought up, just defies all odds. Her true goal is to be just like her father and be a successful scientist. And she makes, <laughs> she's gonna make that happen. <laughs> and also I did enjoy the author's um, personification of the lies. It felt as within the book, they were actually the main character themselves at some points how they would spread like wildfire and blind people from the truth. And I just felt like it illuminated very much on how lies affect people in real life. So, will Faith discover the truth about her father or will she be caught up by all the lies and forced to live a life of false hope? Pick up a copy of The Lie Tree and find out yourself.